Hey guys, real quick video today. We're going to show you how you can set the uh, script execution policy in Windows to allow running PowerShell scripts. So up here it shows that I'm trying to run a script and it won't let me because of the execution policy. So go down here. Um, first we're going to exit out of this shell and start a new shell. So right click on the terminal and say run as administrator. So you do a shift right click to do to get that. But any case, once you have that that up, you're going to say get execution policy. Just to, just just to check, you can type this. You don't have to do this part. But notice it says restricted. So you know you, you can verify that it is in fact restricted. And uh, then we can say set execution policy. Now you can set it to unrestricted. So pretty pretty simple and straightforward there. Just hit enter, and what we're going to do now is, yeah, we, we can say get execution policy. It shows unrestricted, exit out of there, start a fresh terminal without administrative access, just to show we can do this without administrator access. And when we get the policy, it still says unrestricted like it should at this point. So it's always going to be like that, even after you reboot or whatever else. We can go back into our documents directory and run our script and it runs successfully. It prints out hello world. Just a simple demo script. And that's it. If you found this useful, um, give me a thumbs up. You know, leave a comment down below. Uh, hit that subscribe button so you don't miss out on all our great content. Make your YouTube feed way better. And uh, hit that so hit the uh, bell icon. Otherwise, YouTube won't let you know when we come out with new videos. That's pretty much it for today. So thanks for watching and we'll see you on that next video.